Okay, there's creepy, creepy, creepy noises in my house right now, and I'm home alone. Fun story. Hey everybody, it's Bunny, and today I'm going to be doing a very, very, very requested video. And since it's the holiday season, I thought that now would finally be a perfect time to try and accomplish this. What we're gonna be doing is like a Q&A video. And you guys have been requesting this for a million years. I've tried to do this in the past, sometimes very unsuccessfully and sometimes semi-successfully. I'm gonna try it again. Finally, and I think maybe I have like some better strategies with how to do it. I'm not sure why, but sometimes like Q&A videos like give me a little touch of anxiety. Like sometimes like things make me feel anxious and I can't really like put my finger on why. But one of the ways that I try and work through my anxiety is to kind of uh, put myself out there every now and again and try and accomplish something or do something that I didn't think that I could do or that I didn't think that I could handle. Many of you guys know that I have like a super duper fear of traveling, but I've kind of been trying to get on planes more and more over the years so that it's not like, so frightening to me. Anyway, now I'm babbling. I think how I'm going to work the comments down below so that I have some idea and some way of seeing the comments and the questions that come in is I'm going to put this video on comment moderation so that as I'm approving the comments that you guys are leaving, I can read them and like see you guys' name because I would like to give you credit if I answer your question. I think that It'll help me a lot because then I'll feel like I have like some kind of organization over it. I still think that sometimes like YouTube comments can be a little bit squirrely or if there's a lot of comments, I think earlier comments just like get deleted and it's a big crazy thing sometimes. So I think that if I do it on comment moderation, that will make it a whole, whole lot simpler. So I'm gonna try and answer a couple FAQ questions. I think one of my most asked questions of all time is why I don't do paranormal videos anymore. When various articles get written about me on the internet, like people often report facts really wrongly. So despite my name being Graveyard Girl, I always started my channel out. It was literally called like Bunny's Beauty Channel from day one. I'm not even sure if you can like name a channel anymore. I think it's just like whatever, like I'm Graveyard Girl. I don't think it has like that subtitling anymore, but back when I first, first started my channel, it was called Bunny's Beauty Channel and my very first video was a review about fake fingernails. But fetus channel Graveyard Girl, I did do a lot of paranormal videos and definitely my interests in ghosts and paranormal is still there. Like if there is a ghost show on television, I will watch it. I like reading lots of books of ghost stories, whether they're like true accounts or like literal ghost stories, like made up Charles Dickensy kinds of things. And there definitely still is quite a bit of activity at this new house that I live at and still at my old house where I used to live at. But I just have chosen to not investigate anymore or kind of like delve into it or use any of like my sciencey kinds of tools. There was a period in my life, like I think that almost like it was kind of feeding a lot of my depression and kind of making it worse. I feel like a lot of almost negative things were kind of following me around. Definitely at Dogman's old house, um, when he used to live there, there was like some really, really free Freaky, terrible, super bad experience stuff going on over there. So I just kind of decided to let that side of myself go. I just didn't feel like it was a very good personal choice for me anymore. I'm pretty much 90% sure that you're not going to see any more like investigating videos coming from me with the ghost box or anything like that. Maybe in the future I could do some experience videos. I'm not exactly sure how many people would even like that. I don't know, I kinda just like don't talk about it. I feel like the more I talk about it, like the more stuff happens. Anyway, 
anyway, it's that's that's like a, that could be a video in itself. Um, but definitely, uh, that is a question that gets asked a ton on Facebook and even here on YouTube. And I literally have not done a paranormal video probably in over two years probably coming up on three years. So it's been a really, really, really long time. I'm surprised anybody even remembers them anymore. I'm so far away from that. I'm also commonly asked about cameras and equipment-y type things. So my lamps, my setup here is, the, you know what? I will just turn the camera and I will show you. I have a very, very, very simple setup here of a couple of shoe boxes and two craft lamps. I'm sorry that the light is like blinding. So definitely nothing super professional going on here. My camera is the Sony NEX 5-R and I've used some form of the Sony NEX series for like a really, really long time. I just use my MacBook to edit and I use iMovie. I have always wanted to try and like step up my editing game and get into Final Cut, Final Cut Pro X, whatever they call it these days. And I just can never, I don't know. I feel like I'm too stupid. I just, I can't remember all the things. Oh, I'm also often asked how tall I am. And the answer is not very. I'm only five foot three. So definitely I think that it's always like an optical illusion. A lot of times when people meet me, they're like, oh my God, you're so short. And I'm like, yeah, it's just the shoes. The shoes add most of my height. If I just like stand with no shoes, very short. I'm sure there's definitely lots of Swamp family members out there though who are shorter and they probably think 5'3 is not short at all. But like for all of my friends and the rest of my family, I'm like the shortest person. I swear it's because I drank a lot, a lot of coffee when I was a very young child. And I kind of believe that old wives tale that if you drink coffee as a baby, you like stunt your growth somehow from all the caffeine. And I would believe that. I intake way, way, way too much caffeine. Unfortunately, I can't think of any of the other like FAQ kind of questions right now, but maybe I will see them when you start commenting them and I will be like, oh, I've seen that question before. I will answer it. Go ahead, comment down below. You can also ask me questions on Twitter using the hashtag AskBunny, or you can ask me questions on Instagram also using the same hashtag AskBunny. And uh, I think it'll be super fun. And uh, I'm going to try and put this out before Christmas. But if I get too crazy with like the Christmas holiday stuff, I don't know about you guys, but I have been so, so bad with holiday shopping this year. I have like nothing, none of the things. If I get like too crazy and caught up with Christmas kind of stuff, I don't want to like make any promises, but definitely before New Year's Eve, I will make a video in which I answer all of you guys' questions. So let's try and make them fun and super interesting. So I'm definitely not going to get to everybody's question, but I'm gonna try and do like some rapid fire. So you can ask me questions about anything. You can ask me about art or music or movies, or like if I'd rather be an avocado or an armadillo, or like if I didn't live in Texas, what state would I live in? Just, you know, super fun stuff like that. I am looking forward to seeing and reading you guys' questions, and thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I love you guys so, so much, and I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye!